Magandang araw sa inyong mga kaguro. Ngayong araw ay may bago tayong good news at tungkol ito sa ating bagong DepEd Secretary na si Sarah to focus on welfare of DepEd personnel. Para malaman ang buong detalye, please watch this. Sarah to focus on welfare of DepEd personnel. When she takes office in July, Incoming Vice President Sara Duterte promises to look after the welfare of the Department of Education's DepEd teaching and non-teaching personnel. Duterte expressed concern over the position of certain teachers who are deep in debt due to the existence of loan sharks within the agency during a speech during the oath-taking of Davao Occidental elected officials on Friday. That is the sad reality for our teachers. I saw it when I was the mayor of Davao City, said Duterte, the incoming DepEd secretary. She expressed her sadness after learning that the teacher only received a monthly salary of 1,000 Philippine pesos because a large percentage of her income was used to pay off her debts. Duterte said, they were enticed by companies who offered them loans. They were paying big interest rates. She stated that such a predicament has an impact on teachers' work. That is where the sad story is. How you can expect the teachers to work religiously if they are confronted with such a problem, she said. Duterte worried that instructors dealing with personal issues would compromise the quality of education in their classrooms. I only have six years to work with you and to improve your welfare and the quality of education in our country, Duterte said. I am soliciting your support that we might come up with something concrete to improve the welfare of the teaching and non-teaching staff of the DepEd, and see a better country with learners that are disciplined and patriotic, she added. During her service as DepEd secretary, she also confirmed her commitment to generating skilled learners. Yun lamang ang ating update ngayong araw, please don't forget to like, share and subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow our Facebook page, Bifam Salamat.